Okay, so we are going to be working on box number two now. And this is the box that's labeled, Who Am I? Okay, so after we write down some details, we're going in that box, we're going to go to Utah Compose, and we're actually going to write paragraph number two in Utah Compose. So if you did not do paragraph number one yesterday, you need to go back and do that, and then play catch up and do paragraph number two as well. Um, but today, that's the one we're focusing on. So I'm going to go ahead and just hop right in. So this is where we're going to actually put some details, and I'm going to use red this time. We're going to put some details about who we are, okay? Now, everyone in this class is not the same, okay? I could literally look around. I know you're not here, but I could look around. I've met every single one of you, and I can tell you that you're not the same, okay? Now, I'm not talking about, like, your physical appearance, right? Some of you have brown hair, some of you have black hair, some of you have blonde hair, okay, red hair, okay? I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about the same people, right? You're not the same people inside or out. Your families are different. Where you come from might be different, okay? So in box number two, which is labeled two, who I am, we're going to just jot down details, okay? Now, this is not a full-on paragraph. It's just details about who you are. And I'm going to show you my example by doing my own box number two, okay? So for who I am, I might put that I'm from Salt Lake City. Okay, I'm from Salt Lake City. I grew up in Taylorsville, okay? I also mentioned that in paragraph number one. I may put that I teach at Plymouth. That tells people I'm a teacher, right? Um, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to put teacher at Plymouth. Notice how I'm just jotting down details. I'm not writing full-on sentences, right? I attended the University of Utah. That's a big part of who I am. I went to a large university and got my degree for teaching, okay? So I attended the U of U. I'm just going to put attended U of U. Go Utes, right? Okay, attended U of U. I may also include my age, so I'll tell you my age, I don't care. I'm 26 years old, okay? 26 years old, okay? I have one sibling, okay? One sibling, I talked about her in my video for yesterday. I have one little sister, her name's Lindsay. She's not really little, she's 22. But anyway, I have one sibling, okay? So I may put one sibling. Okay, and then I could also include something like I come from a large family. So I'm just going to put lots of family. Okay, now all of these details that I added in box number one are not necessarily going to be a part of that paragraph. Okay, I want to give myself options so that when I'm writing paragraph number two, I don't have to be thinking like, oh man, I should have really thought about some more stuff, right? can always go back to my four square and you've got, I've got one, two, three, six things there. Okay, so I have six things to choose from. I'm really going to pick three or four of them. And I'm going to write and in detail those three or four things. Okay, um, so we're going to leave that there. Paragraph number two, then we'll work on three, four, and five, and then write those. Meet me in the next video and we will work on Utah Compose.